In this video I will show you how to debug uh, an application in JavaScript, what I have here, on the browser side or client side um, with in Visual Studio. In Visual Studio the debugging for uh, this uh, stuff on ASPX side <coughs> uh, works and uh, usually works on the um, on the code behind page of um, of a site where you say okay that's the page load and you set the breakpoint breakpoint on there that's uh, I think that's common for everybody uh, but uh, sometimes you have problems with this uh, client side uh, JavaScript and when you say uh, set a breakpoint there <coughs> in this case I'm checking my uh, offset values uh, from uh, from some elements which I've written there so this is my test button and I want to check this diff block <coughs> and uh, as you see there's a, um, a breakpoint and the breakpoint works when you go there and you're uh, when you, we have the start page we need the debuggers for ASP.NET and it's not, not really necessary to activate the native code and now when I start this uh, this page and I s select the Internet Explorer that's what we, what we will test now. Uh, when I select this one and I start it <coughs> and we run into the debugger then that's the debugger page. Uh, that's that's web page in uh, Internet Explorer last version I think on Windows 10 Visual Studio uh, 2015. And now when I uh, push the test button then <coughs> the <coughs> the debugger runs into the uh, into my application and when I'm there now I see all those ob objects in this case I'm checking for my uh, for my element that's a div test it's called a div test container uh, it's this one is called with the ID div test when I check this one and uh, for example when I drop it in there uh, where are we here when when I look here for my div test <coughs> object then I, you will see this for expanding and have it at, at the watch and you will see all uh, actual values which it has and now I stop this stuff um, and yeah and, and you may drill in all to the deeper uh, values now when I stop that stuff and I'm try to running it in the uh, on Chrome which is um, most common browser at the moment when we start there <coughs> the same stuff Now when say site is uh, starting, it's an ASPX site in the extension. And when I now push my uh, test button, then the, uh, the uh, emulator or the the browser itself does not stop at the breakpoint. And at the moment, I thought I, it's easier. The easiest way is to when you check a Java code is by using the inter uh, the Internet Explorer for Microsoft and uh, some on some forums it was said that uh, it should also be possible to attach uh, the um, uh, the debugger to the uh, to the browser but I didn't find this point at the moment so it's th the fastest way is just uh, set a breakpoint and debug under Internet Explorer. I hope I could help you so and uh, uh, we will go on this stuff.